documentary about the worst school bus crash in U.S. history is about to have its Central Kentucky premiere. It's called The Very Worst Thing, and it chronicles a 1958 school bus crash in Floyd County that killed 27 people. Here's WKYT Stacy Ellison live in our newsroom with details on the film's premiere at the Kentucky Theater downtown later today. Stacy. Good afternoon, Bill. Years after this accident, emotions are still very raw for those who lived through the pain left behind in this Floyd County community. Early this week, directors premiered the film there to a packed house and rave reviews. The very worst thing chronicles a dark day in Kentucky history, and more than a thousand turned out to remember those lost in the tragedy. When we were filming it, we thought that if we would have had two to three hundred people see it, that would have made us happy. John Crum was a student who saw the whole tragedy unfold. He was supposed to be on that bus that crashed into the Big Sandy River. And that is when I seen the hopeless thing I ever witnessed in my life. Crum and others say they were happy to see the event chronicled in this way. And I think that this will bring a closure to a lot of things that was unanswered during the, the disaster because it was an absolutely a wonderful, wonderful film. The documentary was great. I liked it and I cried all the way through it, of course, because this was about friends of mine that I went to school with. The director purposely tried not to show this region in a negative light. This paints uh, Eastern Kentucky and the people of this region as strong, proud people, hardworking, very family-oriented uh, men and women of faith, and I'm really excited about uh, the project. A marker now stands at the site of the tragedy. It was erected a year ago and stands as a constant symbol and reminder that 26 children lost will never be forgotten.